I got the political bug when I was in seventh grade and decided that that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to serve those who need it. Although I was not saving the world, I was doing a lot of great things and, and helping people. A girlfriend of mine who's also into politics, the two of us decided, why don't we go to the Iowa caucus? We got on a plane, and when we were on the plane, all of a sudden, it was in excruciating pain. So I went to the hospital, and they kept diagnosing me as having extreme constipation. It was the night before the caucus, and I called up the GI specialist, and she said, you know what, why don't we bring you into the hospital for testing? Two days later, I woke up, and they informed me I had stage three colon cancer. I want to contribute. I don't want to just be somebody who was here. I want to be somebody who helped others. From that moment on, I really determined I would do anything in my power to live. The only times through this cancer journey that I've truly lost hope was when I thought I had no more options. The American Cancer Society gave me the introduction to the Alliance. It was a lot of younger, energetic people that were really so dedicated to the cause and raising the awareness of it, of the importance of us continuing to fund innovation and research. There's something about the Alliance and the group of people that work and are involved with it that just pulled me in right away. It made me feel loved, and I didn't feel as alone. Because of the Alliance, my life has improved exponentially as far as my feeling like I have a community, my feeling like I have resources, my feeling like somebody cares. Because these people are working day in and day out to see what they can do to help people like me. It's been a real pleasure being able to work for the people that are saving your life. And our goal ultimately being that we find a cure. I've been on every chemo that there is. I've done seven rounds of radiation. I've done four clinical trials. I've had 68 surgeries. My body doesn't have very much more. I want to live so badly. And a lot of the reason why I live so badly is because I want to help other people live too. My wife has been a fighter since the day I met her. Little did she know that she would be facing this with cancer. If the funding was there, if Eve had early detection for everybody, I mean, Eve could have caught this much earlier and potentially be with us today. My wife was always about giving hope because she was so desperate for hope herself. When she contacted the Alliance and saw what they were about, she really started to understand there is hope out there. 